so hello guys welcome back to our youtube channel so in this tutorial video we are going to learn about how to create our 3d wave circle loading animation effects by using css okay so as you can see that this is our file our html file i write down our class name as a circle and i give them the span tag here only so it's create the wave for wave i create write down here span tag only i didn't write down anything here for our creating designing wave okay <coughs> so now let's move forward to our css file so let's write down our first one sorry now let's write down our margin and padding so i'm going to write down margin as a zero and padding as a zero now let's give them the body so let's color packers open and close then display as a flex now let's give, give them the justify content as a center now let's give them the align items as a center minimum height according to your need you can write down here guys okay now let's select the background let's select our color here or anything let's write down red and then let's select different color <coughs> now <coughs> let's move forward to our class so we give our class name as a let's just copy our circle and give them paste it here and color brackets open and close now let's give them the position as a relative now let's give them the width as a 300 pixel now let's give them the height as a 300 pixel now let's give them the transform style transform style we are going to use it here guys now let's write down preserve 3d right now for our 3d okay now let's give them the our circle and our, now our span tag curly brackets open and close <coughs> now let's give them the position now let's open our live server guys so open with live server so as you can see this is how our live server look like now let's give them the position as a absolute now let's give them the display as a flex <coughs> now let's give them the border as a 5 pixel solid black if you want to give them black if you want to give them yellow so let's write down yellow so as you can see there's yellow here now let's give them the box shadow <coughs> so i write down here box shadow so according to a need you need to write down here guys so i'm going to write down here now let's give them comma now let's write down our inset 0 5 pixel we are going to write down here now let's once again write down our this silver color now let's <coughs> write down our box sizing so we are going to write down our box sizing as a border box now let's give them the border radius so i'm going to give them the 50 percent then let's write down our animation so i'm going to give them animation name as animate now let's write down our three second according to your second you can write down here is in out then infinite i'm going to use it here okay now let's move forward to our circle span we are going to use our <coughs> child here so i'm going to give them the first child as a first name now let's curly brackets open and close let's give them the position top left bottom 
and right position we are also going to give them the same as a zero and i'm right going to delay the animation here as a 1.5 second so as you can see this is how it look like so now let's write down over here transform guys so let's write down transform here then we are going to give them the perspective here as a according to your need you can write down here i write down here 500 pixel then rotate I'm going to write down as a rotate as a x angle. Now let's write down 60 degree. So as you can see, my circle is in rotative mode, x rotation mode right now. Now, <coughs> now we are going to write down a child, which uh, whichever span we write down here: one, two, three, four, five, seven. Let's write down 9 here guys. So I'm just going to copy this one. Then paste. So let's write down here second. Here as a third. Here as a fourth. Five. Six. Seven, eight, and nine. It's nine, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes. This is nine. Now we are going to <coughs> give them the different position as our top left and right position. So for now, first we add. Let's add our keyframes here, guys. Okay. So let's write down keyframes as an animate. So I'm going to write down curly brackets open and close. Now let's write down a zero percentage, comma, hundred percentage. Let's curly brackets open and close. Let's write down our transform as a translate the head position i'm going to give them okay according to your need you can write down here <coughs> so as you can see this is how it look like <coughs> now i'm also going to give them the 50 percent here as a curly brackets open and close let's write down our transform as a translate z 100 pixel so as you can see it takes some delay time here guys as you can see now <coughs> we are going to change our position here guys so let's write down our 20 pixel okay so i'm just going to copy this one and paste it here in all right and bottom position so as you can see i'm also going to change the seconds here guys so as you can see it takes a moment as you can see so let's firstly add our seconds here guys as a 0 0.1.2 1.1 second let's write down one second only <coughs> then 0 0.9 now let's give them 0 0.8 and 0 0.7 second as you can see now let's change difference difference pixel here guys the year we use 20 pixel now we are going to use our 30 pixel so as you can see it takes some waves here guys So let's just write down, copy, and paste. So as you can see, now let's give them one more here as a 60 pixel.
If you want to use like this, let's just change all position to 40. So as you can see, it looks different right now. Now let's once again write down KDB self. Copy and paste. Then save as you can see. <coughs> Now let's give them the 100 percent, 100 pixel here, guys. Not percentage, sorry, it's my mistake. As you can see, changing 120 pixel, 120. Now let's give them the 140 pixel. Let's just copy this one and paste and paste and paste. One sixty pixel I'm going to use it here. Let's just copy this one and paste. <coughs> So here is our complete guys. Let's save this file. As you can see. <coughs> well, as you can see there is one more dot here. So we can <coughs> also clear that dot. So let's just write down here. Sorry. Let's just copy this one and let's give them the 10 name. <coughs> let's suppress it, guys. <coughs> So as you can see it's working so let's just change some minor delay here guys so here we are going to use our 0 0.5 second so you can see so let's give them 0 0.6 second and 0 0.7 Here yeah, how you can change the animation delay guys and change the perspective or according to your need you can change that here. Let's refresh it, guys. So, as you can see, this is how it works here. If you want to change this uh, space here, as you can see, there's uh, so many space here. You can also change that if you want to. So, for that, you need to change that one here. So, let's change it. Here, as you can see, there's a space is cutting here. So, according to a need, you can change the space here, guys. Okay, let's select this three and twenty. So, here, as you can see, this is how you can change. 
this space here <coughs> according to your animation you can also change the delay here guys if you have any query write down in the comment section and also don't forget to like share and subscribe bye